Right, the next session before we break for lunch is focusing on research. So we have two people to speak to you today. Um, the second person will be Dr. Gareth Wright from the University of Liverpool. But before that, I'm pleased to be able to welcome our head of research from the MND Association, and that's Belinda Cupid. If you're ready, okay, Belinda? I'll hand you over. I know you've been busy. Good morning. Um, good morning to all of you in the room and to all of you watching online. Um, we've heard overnight from the American Association, the ILS Association in America, um, that, they've, that it's just been announced that they've licensed another drug for motor neurone disease. Um, so this is a new drug that's been licensed, and it's the first time that a drug has been licensed um, since Rilizol was licensed over 20 years ago. So it's a really exciting announcement, but as I said, this is 8 o'clock this morning was the first time that I, we heard about it as a charity. Um, so what does this drug do, and what does it mean for people with MND in the UK? Um, well, we know that this drug, which is known as the Daravone, and um, the company MT Pharma have announced that they're going to be marketing it as something called Radicava. 